When you create your Word or Excel documents for these class assignments, then you need to get them into your Dropbox account. And some students don't know exactly where to place those files. And so let me use this short demo here to show you. Here I've created just a sample Word document file. And you can see that the title of the file is sample word document .docx. And I saved this to the desktop. So if I come in here and show you the desktop behind this screen, you can see that here is that file on my desktop. So I come in now to this Dropbox folder that I've created. And I've created this Dropbox folder as a demonstration. I created it exactly the same way that I ask you to create your Dropbox folders. And so what I'm seeing here should be exactly what you are seeing. Whenever you create a Dropbox account, they always come with a public and photos folder. These are put there by Dropbox. And what some students are doing is this. They will, in order to upload their file, they will click Upload, and then go to Choose File, and then they'll go to the desktop, and then they'll find that file, and select Open. Dropbox will automatically upload the file, and then click Done. And I think a lot of students are just stopping here because they see that they're in their Dropbox folder and they see that the file has been submitted. But the problem is, is that this file that I just uploaded to Dropbox is not where your instructor is going to be able to see it because the folder that is shared is this folder right here. And this shared folder, the folder that has the two little stick figures of people on it, which this is the symbol for a shared folder. That folder is here. And in order to get this file to where your instructor can see it, then you've got to get this file inside of this folder. So you can think of this folder here as like a garage. And this maybe this area out here is just like the driveway. And so right now, this file is just sitting here in the driveway, but it's not in the garage. So what you need to do is you can just left click hold and drag this up here and drop it in there. You could do it that way. Or you could just open this file or um, open this folder that is and make sure that it shows the proper name right here, the COSE 2311 and then do your upload again. Done. And now you can see that this file is inside of that folder and if I go back one level, then I can see that that file is still here, where, where I originally put it. And since it needs to be up here, I'll go ahead and click on this folder. And you can see that it is there. So if I go back, I could come here now and just delete that file. And so you don't see that folder that that file I'm sorry you don't see that file here outside of the containing folder or the shared folder but if I click that shared folder there it is so when you submit your assignments you have to make sure that you're not just placing them in your Dropbox account but that you're placing them inside of the shared folder that you received whenever you accepted the link from me uh, to get started in this class and then so you open this folder that's got the two shared images and you put all of your assignments right here. And that's all you do. You don't need to uh, like uh, click here and, and share that link with me. You don't need to do anything. When you place that file inside of this folder, you can see it and I can see it. And that's all that you need to, to do.